to upgrade or not? It's the age old question I get from sellers who are prepping their homes to sell. Which projects should you do? Which ones are a waste of money? And which one is going to give you 147% back on your investment? I've got the top six most valuable home projects you can do when getting your home ready to put on the market. Be sure to stay for number six. It's the best one. Selling your home often comes with a long list of things you've got to do to get it ready. Decluttering, painting, staging. But in addition to that, what about remodeling or home projects? There are certain things that give you a good bang for your buck and others that really don't. According to NAR, the National Association of Realtors and Realtor.com, these are the top six projects that give you the most return when you're selling. The first is vinyl siding with an 82% ROI. So if you spend $100, you're gonna get 82 back. A garage door came back with a 100% ROI. So if you've got a door that doesn't work or a garage door opener that's on the fritz, it's worth every penny to get it fixed. Number three was roofing with a 100% return on investment. And again, especially in the state of Florida where we are, because of hurricanes and storms, one of the main questions people ask when buying a home is how old is the roof? So in our area, if your roof is hitting that 15 year or older mark, it's a really good thing to think about. Number four was upgrading the insulation. On average, that provided a full return on investment. And the last two have to do with flooring. Number five was adding new wood flooring. That was a 118% ROI. Buyers these days, for the most part, like to walk into a turnkey house. So if the flooring's already been upgraded and done well with a good product, you're gonna see that reflect in the price. And the last one is refinishing hardwood floors. If you're lucky enough to have gorgeous hardwood floors, get them polished up and looking amazing because that's gonna give you 147% ROI. I have found these things to be true in Florida especially when it comes to roofs. As I said before, we deal with hurricanes and storms and roofs are one of the major selling points of a house. In fact, it's one of the first questions most buyers ask. In addition to that, I find lots of buyers don't want a ton of projects when they're moving into a house. Moving is already stressful enough, let alone adding on DIY projects. So things like flooring, the garage door are all gonna be things that come back into your wallet. You gotta pay to play. Spend money to make money. And so on and so forth. But make sure at the end of the day that you're spending it in the right areas so that you can recoup the most from your investment. Certain upgrades are worth every single penny when you're getting your home ready to sell. Not only in the direct return on investment, but often in the amount of time that your property sits and how many repairs you get stuck doing. Now, perhaps your questions go beyond whether or not to remodel. I'm Lindsay Johnson, your resource for all things real estate. See you next time.